Welcome back, everybody. I'm your host, Seki Man, and this is episode 16 of my Bolt Crusader Achievement Run. Uh, last episode, we were just um, rebuilding our nation up from our war against Muscovy, so replacing mercs, building some heavies, uh, increasing development, etc. Um, and yeah, we're going to continue doing that this episode, getting ready for a war. I think it's going to be Poland as our next uh, a target, so hopefully we can do that this episode. Um, but I'm not sure yet, but let's let's continue anyway. Oh, that's not good. He's no longer emperor. Maybe he's got a queen or why not? Why don't you have an emperor? Ah is there's yeah, that's why. Well that makes him significantly weaker, but he's still a strong ally. I'm proud to have him. Yeah, we are losing. Uh, we, are, we are losing. Uh, oh, come on, game. Nice to me. Oh my god, that's six inflation now. Shoot. I don't want six. Six is just too high. Wait, yeah, I thought we had economic. I thought we had a. I thought cheap would be cheaper to. Reduce inflation. Oh no, it's just yearly inflation. Okay. Well, it is going down, but that's super high. Let's do. Let's, yeah, let's just bring it down manually. I mean, we'll make more money this way. Everything will be cheaper. I hate to spend admin points like that, but I also need to have a decent economy, which we don't have. Any, so. I mean, we do. It's just I want it better. Payback alone will help. Missionaries are coming in quite nicely. Missionaries are coming. Missionaries are converting quite nicely. There we go. All right, let's keep fabricating, right? We should be focusing on who are your allies anyway. Novgorod Bavari, that's great. So I want to take land from Novgorod. I want to take land from Poland, Lithuania. I want to take land from everywhere. Just all the all the dirt. We want all the dirt. All of it. How are we looking? We can have a, so I think now is the time to build some cannon. Let's, let's do three cannon. And no, I can't do three cannon. Oh, money. I didn't think Poland is arriving, huh? Interesting. Okay. So because he's in Regency, I find the AI is like eager to war, you know? So we're getting really close. I'd love to pay off all my debts. And it's like, how am I going to deal with this? So the Navy should be a problem. I mean, Poland doesn't have a Navy. It's only going to be Novgorod. And I'm pretty sure we can handle that with just five heavies. His, his navy is very weak now. I would love to build buildings, man. Okay, more cannons. Missionaries are almost done. That'll help out a lot. Reduce your revolt risk. I gotta pay attention to Don's egg. It's at forty percent now. Hopefully, I don't make that same blundering mistake I did with Moscow. I'm just like the four off. Ugh. And my movements down. I think they ticked up like really fast. I just just caught caught my pants down. Awesome. Getting awfully close for pickup. Let's 
Sweet. Oh, come on. Must be vassalize them. That's kind of bullshit. We shouldn't be able to vassalize them so fast like that. That's that's really, really disappointing. That's that's actually quite bull I find that bullshit. Like I mean he was released from Muscovy in a war and he's like, yeah, let's let's be vassals again. What? I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be a pretty significant negative. Not with this game. This game, you know. Let's just start it. And I, I gotta hire that. Uh, yeah, I don't wanna hire that uh, uh, Inquisitor. I really do. He still have men at arms, I just saw. Him. Four of them gonna be exact. Let's double check again. I thought I got rid of them before and I didn't. So, not be good. Yeah, okay, now we've got rid of them, so. Couple more cannon. I think that brings us to a force in there, right? No, it does not. Two more. Two more infantry. I got time. Early. Never mind. No point in attacking up early. It's just a waste of water points. I mean, there is a point sometimes to attack up early. Like, if you're in a war, like against Muscovy, for example, attacking up early is not a bad thing there. That's the turn of the year, will we'll be minus five, so. Now it's tech up time. Mm. I need to uh, upgrade my fleet. Man, I need to do so many things with my money. Increase your troops to what? Increase upgrade our troops, sorry. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, it's not these, it's good. It's cavalry. Can't. Cavalry upgrades me very, very nice. If you take a look at what we had before, that's a huge upgrade. Take the culverin. Shock damage, I like that. And fan. So now we can have better galleys. Fact, let's bring out the galleys now and we'll upgrade those right away. That's expensive. We need to claim more more dirt. Well, can we do nope, oh, okay. Well let's focus here, okay. No. Don't need to do that yet. We're not going to be able to take much from Noah Broad. We're not going to call this Pope Lurger because he's allied with Sweden, I think, yeah. And I don't want to fight Poland, Lithuania, Noah Broad, and Sweden. All this. Not necessary. Okay, so we're going to start paying back, start paying back our loans. What was this? Okay, great. That's good. Rival of rival. Hansa. Don't think that's going to happen. Oh, that's not going to happen. So far away from the wall. Well, we dumped our ally here, Pomeranian, we could, I think. But I'm, I'm not going to do that. Conquer Torzog. I like that. 
Where's toys? That's right there. Okay, we'll try that one out. Rebels are at 60%, so I think it's time to move some troops over there. Actually, this is my area. Let's do it. Um, yeah, I don't really care if I lose the target all that much. I need to send uh, I need to send Franz to give some good old fashion to uh, Galicia's monarch. He's getting a little upset. Oh, look at that. Good. Okay. Well, now that, now I, I don't mind waiting so long. That is going to be an opportunity. Uh, no, fuck you and fuck you. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> No, 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 absolutely not. So this is good. This is really good. Now, Muskie can't fight this, I'm sure. It is pitiful. He should be really weak still. Yeah, he's, he's terribly weak. <coughs> so. Yeah, it's going to be. Ew. Um, all right, we'll lose a devotion. Seventy percent. Oh, I really want to hire that inquisitor. So, like, this would be be an easy war for Novgorod and uh, Poland Lithuania. It should be pretty damn easy. Are you at war too? No, you didn't call Sweden. In. Interesting. Polish land, right? Let's come back from here. In the papal states. <coughs> and we'll just keep fabricating and pull on again. Oops. Come on. Rebels are at 80%. Alright, let's let's put up our maintenance. We don't want to be caught by pants down again. Don't need to turn any ports on. Don's like will just spawn there. But that should, um, I really want that, yeah. I really want them just to spawn, as a matter of fact. So, in fact, I'm going to pull this guy out to increase the revolt risk. Because recent rebel uprising will give us minus 20 revolt risk, and that'll be perfect. I don't want to have to deal with revolts while I'm at war with uh, Poland Lithuania. But we can pay back a loan. Let us do that. I think we just have one loan left. But, oh my god, no, we pay back all loans. How amazing are we? Oh, baby, look at that. Military reforms, military power, morale of armies, military tech, until 1524. It's only five years. Oh, wow. Hmm. Yeah, military makes sense. We are, yeah, we're in the middle of uh, working on, <coughs> excuse me, um, military idea group, so. <coughs> oh, my God. It's cold. It's just never ending. All right, cool. We'll get another national idea, or divine idea, as they're called. <coughs> it is only fort defense, and I don't really care about that. Come on. Hurry up and spawn. Okay, so yes, please catching up. Okay, this is going to be good, right? Yes, missionary strength. Yes, I like this too. Cheaper stability. Our tax is really good. Good. So that'll really help the conversion of Moscow a lot. Oh yeah. Good God. Fantastic. We have our force limit. Yeah. 
are, they were over on the ships. We can hire no general for that. Let's take a look at their armies. I still have the fourth biggest army in the world behind. Wow, look at the Ottomans. That's scary. Poland 28. His manpower is low already. He's had a ton of manpower. So that's, a, that's a big army. We'd have to fight. Let's see. 20, 21, 45, oh, uh, 75,000 troops. Uh, we would be outnumbered. We would be outnumbered. I don't think my allies will join me. I mean, Pomeria will, they would, but that's not that great. Well, that would be, that would be a really tough war. Now, I'm hoping, I'm, uh, what would be really nice is if, <coughs> excuse me, is if uh, Muscovy can do enough to damage their, get them war exhaustion and, and hurt them a lot. I, I just don't see it happening. Muscovy is so weak. I just don't know how we're going to fight these three guys. Poland. Pause for stage. The only thing we have going for us is their Eastern Tech, and we're not. They are Tech 9, and we're Tech 10. It's not a big enough advantage, I'm afraid. I need allies is what I need. Maybe he'll make, uh, must be break his vassalage of prayer and we can get that as an ally again. It's just so tough. There's no one here that would care to ally us. I mean, even no guy. Oh my God. But would he help us? That's the question. I don't know if he would. But I mean, he's. I, I'm gonna take. Uh, I mean, how big? How strong is no guy? No guy. Where's no guy? Not that impressive, is it? But hey, it'll help balance out the the, the odds. I just don't think he can help. I don't think he'll get access either. No guy hates him. Yeah, it's not that great of an ally. Well, Crimea would ally. Could have pulled Crimea. Which no he's that high. He's not that much worse than a no guy. What's his tech? Tech seven. Well, you know, it's another distraction, and I think. Fuck game. How many errors am I going to lose? Alright, so. Maybe it's worth doing this. Maybe we can get Pomerini and Friendly, so we'll try it. How oh, crappy is he? He's much crappier than our last error, but you know, he's average. Reformation in Saxony. National Bank pays dividends. That I can get behind. Now. Hmm. <coughs> man, oh man, I'd rather have a dock here, but that's a lot of manpower it would provide us. <coughs> I think what I should be building are conscription centers. I think, uh, yeah, I just need more manpower, uh, force limit. I need a bigger army to deal with these guys. Let's take a look at these, how they're doing. How are you guys doing? 30k, no manpower is good. I mean, that's a huge advantage. He's got tons of manpower, though. Now, Brian, he's getting low on manpower. But I'm pretty sure Muscovy is dead in the water here. Yeah, yeah he's pretty weak. But he'll hire Mercs. Okay, do we ally Crimea? I think we should. Who hates him? Theodoro, Janon, and Muscovy, that's fine. 
Okay, we'll do it. It's defensive, but he, I think uh, he rivals the autumn of must. That doesn't help though. Let's just see. Austria is the only person who would join. It's bad. Mel Barbari would join. God darn it. God darn it. I would love to have Bohemia. It would be just so amazing. Just, I don't think it's possible. He's, I mean, he's 33 back, and I can only improve relations 21. And that's not going to be enough. Okay, well, there's always... Oh, what is this? Oh, Bohemia is at war. Oh, that's that's very good. I didn't. I totally forgot about that. So, come on, Bohemia, yeah. Well, he's weak, too. Crappy. Let's keep improving here. Or must be. Danzig, spawn. Please spawn. Begging you, spawn. Be a bro. It's pretty good. I like my ducats. A lot higher force limits. Hey, I can reduce maintenance for now. That, that will actually help the whole risk. <coughs> you just have to be careful. Pay attention. When I get to 90, I'll bring my force limit or my maintenance up to say, I don't know, 75%. And I'm really sorry, guys. I know I'm coughing a lot. It's, I've had this cold for nearly a month. Uh, crap. Well, there goes that opportunity. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. What did you do? Wow, why is he so unhappy with me? All right, we'll send hugs out there. Everybody loves a good hug. See Styria. You're blind. Oh my God, he's way up here. Okay. Who are you allied with? We're in more. Well, shitty. Very very shitty. I need allies. You keep bleeding that manpower. You're getting your butt handed you. What's Bohemia doing down here? Not much. Not much. Getting hungry, we bring in another 22,000 troops as well, so that's good. Melgar's getting really weak. Oh, wow. Oh, no, okay. Poland is no manpower. Hmm. Alright, it's executive decision time. Once Austria gets out of his war, I, I have to take advantage of this. Sit. 
Yeah, I'd rather you declare war on me, Poland. That'd be great. What am I kicking out with? Oh, shit. Really, Pomerania? Really? Really? You really think you can fight the Hansa? That's a mistake. I think he's like hoping I'm gonna back him up. Well, I'll join the war anyway. That should hopefully bring him to friendly with us. Okay, so what's the navy like? Okay, so that's bad. Ish. So what I want to do here is get my galleys out, unball ball. That's good. Really good is unmothballing my fleet. We're still doing pretty good on ducats. And why am I not surprised? Oh, Tom Rainey, you dumb dumb. Okay, they're up to 90%, so I think it's time to turn up a little bit more. We just got to be careful. Once they spawn on our face, we reinforce, max out our maintenance. Uh, Increase relations here. I'm not sure that our alliance with Crimea is going to last or how useful it's going to prove to be, but. How are your militaries doing, guys? Austria's strong. Poland, you know, he's still strong, but no, no manpower is really good. Lithuania is not getting hurt at all. God, oh, man, that's a lot of troops, though. The thing is, is once Austria leaves and ends his war, hopefully it'll be sooner than they peace out, but you just never know. I'm not sure what you guys are doing. You're getting seized up. Look at that little cow over there. Jesus. All right, guys, I'm at the end of the episode here. I know it's a little bit slow right now, but that's kind of the way it has to be. I can't just war with Poland, Lithuania, no, brother. They're a very strong alliance with a lot of troops. I need my allies, and even then, it's it's tenuous, to say the least. It's, it's scary. So, yeah, come back next time. Hopefully, we will be ready to war with uh, Poland, not Lithuania, and Novgorod sooner than later. And I'm hoping that they're accumulating a shitload of war exhaustion. That's what's nice about fighting in Russia. So, anyways, have a good one, everybody.